sure that you will stay healthy, as healthy as you can, throughout the course of the regular season? Um, same thing um, I've been doing. Um, just got to make sure that, you know, we, I don't know, um, you know, you just, it's a matter of if you're going to trip on somebody. Uh, you know, a lot of my injuries last year, I stepped on somebody's foot or run into somebody. So um, we get, got to control what we can control and, um, you know, get the treatments that we can at the time. So uh, listen to your body and keep moving and see what happens. Next, Kelly. Hi, good morning, Kwai. Kelly Johnson with Fox 11. I uh, would love to hear your thoughts on the new uh, NBA player participation policy. Um, what are they? <laughs> just, you know, I know that you've gotten a lot of flat for, you know, load management and just, you know, only resting certain players, you know, in certain situations. So uh, just would love to hear your thoughts on that. Um, I just don't know the policy. Like, um, what is the policy? Though? Just okay. I'm going to ask you a different question, if that's okay. Yeah. All right. Sorry. Cool. No, it's totally okay. Um, just would love to know how you're feeling, and if you did anything differently in the off season that maybe you hadn't tried in previous off seasons. You know, I mean, uh, I mean, you try different stuff every year. I mean, every every year is a new journey. So every day, so. Um, you do new things, but you gotta, you know, just keep keep going. Uh, there's nothing new that happens. Uh, you're either gonna get hurt, or you're just gonna be lucky enough to, you know, play games throughout the playoffs or the whole regular season. So, um, with that being said, if if you're not injured, people play basketball. So nobody isn't just trying to get to a certain amount of games or. Uh, well, at least me. I'm not trying to get to a certain amount of games. I'm trying to play the games that I could play. And if I'm hurt, I can't play basketball. So the last two years, been unfortunately for me, uh, I got hurt, tore my ACL. Then at the end of the year, tore my meniscus. And I mean, I just just basketball. <laughs> I'm a two-way player. Um, play hard, so the injuries are going to come up. I'm not out there just walking around. I play both ends of the floor. I see the best players on both ends every night. Either I'm guarding the best player or the best players guarding me. So whatever happens with that, that happens. Yeah, if the injury comes, that's what happens. I'm an NBA. Thank you. Beth, um, Kawhi, in regards to the league policy, I think uh, the gist of it is that they want their top 50 stars out on the floor every night if possible. And given that, I'm just wondering if you feel an obligation to play every game. No, I mean, I'm not a guy that's sitting down because I'm um, doing a load management. Like, low, my, when I was with the Raptors, it was different. Like, I was coming from an injury. And you have to know the details of a doctor. Um, but if the league is seeing or trying to mock what I did with the Raptors, then they sh should stop because I was injured during that whole year. Um, but other than that, if I'm able to play, I play basketball. Um, you know, I work out every day in the summertime to play the game, not to sit and watch people play. Um, no. So no league policy is helping me to play more games. Um, if you say basketball asks you, would you play in the Paris Olympics? Oh, uh, yeah. I wanted to play this summer, but I had other obligations, and I would have had to leave early, so I wasn't able to go. So we'll see what happens. We're going to get the microphone over to Tomer. Hey, Kawhi, good to see you. Um, I, I'm just curious if, if this summer was at all different for you coming off the uh, the rehab you had last year versus the rehab you had this year. Uh, <clears throat> it's, a, it's totally different. Um, ACL is whatever. I mean, you're tearing a ligament and meniscus is a quick cleanup. Uh, but at least for me it was. So it wasn't a whatever eight-month process of trying to build a leg strength or build a tendon back. It's just more of a just letting the uh, uh, get swelling get out the knee, and then you're pretty much good to go. Yeah. 